Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to another edition of the Android News Byte. Today, I wanted to highlight another new feature that has been added to the Google Play Integrity API. If you remember, back in July, I uploaded a video to the channel that spoke about a new update from Play feature for the Google Play Store. It allowed the Android operating system to know where an application had been installed from, and Google Play could then use that data to then allow you to update that app from the Play Store instead of its original source. So apps installed from the Play Store would be labeled as such, and apps installed from the Galaxy Store, for example, would be labeled differently. Now, it looks as if the Google Play Integrity API has been updated to leverage a similar piece of information. Apps installed from the Play Store are now being labeled as licensed, while apps that are sideloaded and installed from other sources are labeled as unlicensed. The update to the Google Play Integrity API now gives developers the ability to check and see if their app is licensed or not, essentially checking to see if it was sideloaded or if it was installed from a legit source, like the Play Store. If an application is labeled as unlicensed, then the developer has the option to block usage of that app or game. Instead of opening the app like normal, the user will see a dialog prompt like this saying that you will need to get it from Google Play if you want to continue using it. Granted, the developer has the option to allow this dialog to be dismissed, but they can also put up a hard block here and prevent that from happening, essentially blocking the user from using the application because it had been sideloaded or installed from another source. Tapping the blue Get App button here will direct the user to the actual Google Play Store page for the app where they can then install from Play to get it from the Google Play Store. Now that will actually delete the existing app from the phone and remove all app data associated with it. So it will not be an actual update that lets you keep all of your data. That new app will then be installed from Google Play so the developer knows the user has a legit copy. You can see how this is yet another way of Google reducing the openness of Android. Being able to sideload the latest version of an application from a place like APK Mirror is a popular option among many power users, especially when it can take days to weeks before a new application update is rolled out to everyone. But sadly, Applications and games are already implementing this new Google Play Integrity API feature. Google will say this is another way that developers can guarantee their apps have been installed from a proper source, a way for them to know that their app has not been modified and then shared online. As sideloading is a popular attack vector for hackers, who want to spread malware. However, I have a feeling that this is not going to have much of an impact here, and it will only allow developers to lock down their apps even further. But let me know what you think about this change down in the comments section below. And please, do not forget to like this video while also subscribing to the channel for more Android news like this.